Welcome back, Charlie here. Can you imagine a prison where the inmates aren't even allowed to dream? What about a prison where everything is painted pink, in order to mess with the inmates' minds and psychology? These prisons really do exist around the world. Some are so bad, they're literally classified by the governments that run them. Salt Pit Location, Kabul, Afghanistan Operated by Central Intelligence Agency of the United States. Inmates, some of the most scary people in the world, including many terrorists and terror cell leaders. Salt Pit is a prison that officially does not exist. The name Salt Pit is actually a code name used by the CIA. The prison is what's known as a black site prison, also known as a dark prison. Inmates are taken here off the record and everything that goes on inside this prison is classified. But thanks to several leaks, we do know what happens inside Salt Pit. Salt Pit is said to be worse than Guantanamo Bay. Inmates describe it as hell on earth. It is one of the most strict prisons in the world. Despite it being located in Afghanistan, it is a US-run prison. The USA is not allowed to run prisons in other countries, but the CIA is. So that's why it's overseen by the CIA. The prison houses 119 detainees. The prison is designed to be the worst place imaginable. Most days, the prison is dark at all times. There are almost no windows, and the windows that do exist are covered up. This keeps the inmates in total darkness and isolation 24-7. There's also no bathrooms inside this prison. Instead, inmates are only given a single bucket. During the winter months, the prison gets freezing cold, but there are no heaters inside the prison at all. The prison is so bad, inmates aren't even allowed to sleep or dream. Inmates never know what time it is, so they don't go into REM sleep as often as normal. They basically have no sleep schedule, kind of like me, but I'm not being interrogated by the CIA. Prisoners do have cells, but there's also a central arena. Inmates normally spend time here, but sometimes the inmates are not given clothing. Prison guards sometimes also spray cold water onto the inmates. Sometimes inmates are even chained in one position standing up. One detainee said that he had to do this for 17 days. Just imagine not being able to sleep or even lay down for that long. That's over half a month. Sometimes inmates are even deprived of food. It's kind of crazy that Guantanamo Bay gets so much press, but despite being even worse, this prison is barely ever reported on in the news, almost like they don't want you to know it even exists. The prison was opened in 2002, but its existence was only discovered in 2006. It's safe to say many of the people in this prison have done very bad things. But does that make it okay for the USA to do these bad things to the inmates? Many would say that two wrongs don't make a right. But what do you think? Black Dolphin One country that is known for its tough prisons is Russia. But there's one prison that sends a chill down the spine of any Russian criminal. The prison is named Black Dolphin. It's named this because of the Black Dolphin statue outside. Inmates are taken to this prison blindfolded. The blindfold is not taken off until they're locked inside their cells, where most of them will remain for the rest of their lives. The prison is located in the Oblast region of Russia near its border with Kazakhstan. The prison is surrounded by nothing but snow and forests. This means if anyone did escape, they would simply freeze out in the snow. But since the prison's creation in 1745, no one has escaped. Inmates are walked around the prison bent over. This means they can't map out the prison or plan any escapes. They're also blindfolded whenever they're transported between buildings. The prison is incredibly strict, and all of the inmates are subjected to hard labor. They have to work all day, every day, and don't even get any payment. Some prisoners which are deemed too dangerous are kept inside their cells all day. They may not be allowed to go outside for even one hour per day, and they're kept under 24-hour surveillance and supervision. No one is getting J.E.'d inside this jail. 
Now, you may feel bad for the inmates as this prison is so strict, but the 700 people inside this prison are some of the worst people in Russia. This includes people who have done terrible harm to others, and in some cases, even cannibals are kept inside Black Dolphin. The inmates are kept behind not one, not two, but three sets of bars. RT travelled to interview one of the prisoners inside Black Dolphin Prison. He said that in Black Dolphin, it's very hard to remain human. You are treated as an animal, and it's hard to stay human. After all, even most animals in zoos are not kept behind three bars. The prison is freezing cold. In the winter, the guards have winter coats and hats, but the inmates only have thin cotton clothing. There's also no heating system inside the prison. Pink Prison When you think of prisons, the last thing you think of is the colour pink. The colour pink is associated with girliness and friendliness. Most prisons are made in a brutalist style, and have very grey and depressing colours. But what if I told you there's a specific shade of pink made just for prisons? It is known as Baker Miller Pink. And many prisons in Switzerland and other countries are painted in this colour. The reason why is because Baker Miller Pink is designed to calm you down. The reason these prisons are painted pink is to psychologically engineer the inmates. The colour your room is has a big impact on your brain. So, to avoid prison fights and conflict, the walls are painted pink. Some say that it's bad to psychologically alter people's minds. But if it reduces violence in prison, then maybe it's a good thing. Many of the inmates are not happy with these colours. They say they feel very embarrassed, and it feels like they're sleeping in a little girl's bedroom. I must admit, it does look rather weird. But if it actually does calm inmates down, then maybe it's a good thing. Colony 8 Colony 8 is known as Ukraine's worst prison. It's located in Zhytomyr, northern Ukraine. The prison is incredibly run down and scary. It's also very overcrowded. There are over 600 prisoners inside, but it was built for only 400. It was originally served as a Soviet gulag, but today it's a modern prison housing some of the worst people in Ukraine. It's also known to be very chaotic and poorly run. When a prisoner arrives, there is no paperwork, fingerprinting, or photo taken. Instead, they're simply strip searched and locked up. Surprisingly, there are some areas of this prison which are fairly low security. There are big windows with no bars, meaning you could easily escape. But no one even dares to try. There are guard towers around the prison with armed guards. And all around the prison is just snow. This means you would freeze before ever getting to safety. Prisoners are not allowed visitors. So you can't even plan an escape with someone on the outside. In its 110 year history, no one has escaped Colony 8. Fuchu Prison If you're a criminal in Japan, then you'd better not get caught. That's because there's a chance you'd be sent to Fuchu Prison. Inside Fuchu Prison, life is heavily restricted. Prisoners are subject to lots of strange psychological tricks. Prisoners are not even allowed to speak, even during visits with family. Prisoners are also not allowed to look up. They must always look down at the ground. Also, there's 44 hours of compulsory labour each week. Prisoners can't even sit how they like. There is a chart inside their cells telling them how to sit. If any of these rules are broken, then inmates go to solitary confinement. They have to kneel on the floor for 10 hours a day, and sometimes for months at a time. Fuchu Prison has been operating for 90 years, and during that time, there's never been a single escape. The Tiger's Cage I think by now we all know that China does not have a good track record when it comes to prisons, but Qin Sheng Prison is known as the worst prison in China. It's nicknamed the Tiger's Cage. It's about a one hour drive from Beijing, and it's described as a prison for the fallen elite. This basically means any corrupt politicians, or any politicians who pose a threat to President Xi. The prison is incredibly tough and hard to escape. Although the cells are not bad, it is very strict. 
Many of the prisoners are sent there for life. And I don't mean 25 years like in the US. I mean they will be there until the day they die. There has never been a single escape from this prison. Some even say tigers roam the grounds of this prison to keep anyone from escaping. But it's not known if this is true or merely a scare tactic to keep inmates inside. If it is merely a scare tactic, then it seems to be working. But now it's time to make your voice heard. Comment below which of these prisons was the most scary. Be sure to check out my second channel for short videos. But as always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, then leave a like. And if you haven't already, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.